G'day all. Uh, is the next video the final one for this lot anyway? Um, here's a the retort. We're gonna retort the amalgam from the last video and get our gold back out of it. So it's pretty basic. I copied it off uh, the internet. Uh, they call it a tube retort. Basically, just a metal plate metal rod with a little holding cup on the top that's where you put your amalgam sit it in a bucket put some water in the bucket and put a steel tube over the top of it so basically as the amalgam heats the mercury gases off will flow down into the water cool and it'll turn back into a liquid and stay in the bucket. Uh, you can heat it with a LPG blowtorch, but I've uh, got plenty of wood around here, so I'm going to set up this grate and I'll do it like that. All right, I'll set her up and I'll be back in a minute. Alrighty, so I've got the retort set up in the bucket now. I've um, Got a piece of sheet metal underneath it to keep ash and crap from the fire from going in the bucket. And a grate here. Um, my amalgam, I've wrapped up in this piece of paper. It's sitting in the cup ready to go. Now we just got to stick the lid on. This is the best part of the job actually. Just gotta start a fire and sit around and have a beer and wait for it. So yeah, it's um, it's you, you don't really want to have to be doing it again and pulling it out halfway. So what I found generally, at least 45 minutes like this. Um, so generally two beers. If you want to make sure it's definitely done, have three beers. All right, so I'll, um, I'll come back once I've heated it up and we'll show you the result. All right. Finish heating it up. That's three gears. Should be plenty. I'm gonna cool this tube down now. Make sure you cool the tube down properly uh, to make sure that all the mercury gas is reformed in the liquid.
when you take it off, you've got to do it slowly because there'll be a bit of a vacuum in there from the heat and the air temperature. So you just do it real slowly. Make sure your paper's fully burnt like that. If your paper's not fully burnt, then that's a sure sign that you haven't left it on long enough. You can see the mercury sitting on the plate. Grab some more water and I'll show you the next bit. Oh yeah. I'll just take this over to my pan here. Make sure all the mercury's washed off that base plate. Water. Dip it in like that. Put rubber gloves on now just in case. I haven't done it long enough, and there's still some mercury on it. Oh. Worked out perfect. Gold and black stuff's just the burnt paper. Look at that. Get all the black stuff off it. Uh, that's my amalgam there. Oh, well, not amalgam no more. That's all gold. And all the mercury's in that bucket there. So uh, it's got a little bit of ash in it, so I'll, I'll pan it off in a minute and snuff the mercury back up. But I'll just wash this off and take her in and weigh it up. Oh yeah, here's the bit we've all been waiting for. Finally got my amalgam. I'll stick her on the scales and see how much gold we got. 21.2. grams. Very nice. There's a nice from one bucket of concentrates from the nuts and bowl. So I'm pretty bloody happy with that. That's a ripper. Cheers all. <laughs>